Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a special guest with me, my boyfriend hey. Brandon. Since it's Valentine's Day, I figured it'd be kind of fun to do like a little quiz each other because then you guys can learn a little bit about us and I can also learn if you know anything about me. And yeah, we'll see about that. <laughs> so we have our list of questions. We're going to try to make this fast, but we all know that I talk too much. So we're just going to dive right into this video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy and also hit subscribe before you leave. It means so much to me. And oh, man, my let's get into too. this video. So my first question is, what was our first date? Depends on what you consider a first date. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess we didn't really have like an official first date. Mm -hmm. Not really. What would you call our first date? Mm -hmm. Probably the night we went out to the beach. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I would say too. Yeah, we watched the sunset on the beach. Yeah, at our little it. secret spot. Oh, well, your secret spot. Secret. <laughs> <clears throat> your turn. What's my middle name? <laughs> Edward. <laughs> it's actually funny because I said that you were my Edward Cullen. <laughs> what? I was. I loved Twilight back in the day, and Edward Ugh. Cullen was like the the guy. Alright, anyways. Yeah, I don't know about that guy. My mm. question number two is where did we first meet and what was your first impression of me? Um, like truly meet or yeah. ran into each other? Ran into each other, I would say. Well, that'd be it. Ryan and Holly's. Mm -hmm. At a birthday party. It's actually kind of a funny story. So, we like knew about each other like we knew of each other but i wasn't really interested and he wasn't really interested and when i was interested he was dating somebody else and when he was interested i was dating someone else so it was just really bad timing but my mom actually was like at one of the birthday parties because we have a common i guess family member <laughs> it's kind of like well, a I weird way to i guess common family members so. yeah so he was at the birthday party that <clears throat> i was at for different families and basically my mom was like you sh he's really cute like you should get his number and I was like mom stop like stop trying to set me up with this guy I had like no interest whatsoever and then all of a sudden I was like wait a second maybe I do have a little interest <laughs> in him so that would be our first first like yeah. time meeting each other what was your first impression of me mm, I don't know I don't remember that long ago what a long time <laughs> what would you say if you had to guess if I had to guess, I probably thought you were cute. Oh, I'm adorable. Yeah, you know, the basic one. <laughs> so mean. I'm just just cute. Oh, well, I don't know. A long time ago. Yeah, it was. We've been dating like four and a half years at this point. What's your next one? Ooh, what kind of films do I like? Action. Yeah. For sure. Mm. Like you're Fast and Furious, and yeah, I'd say action yeah. movies. Yeah, action is the best one. Question number three. What's the weirdest thing about me? Mm. <laughs> I don't know if I want you to answer this. What is the weirdest thing about you? Yeah. The weirdest thing about you. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah. Is the fact you have to chew on every straw <laughs> that. This is not a lie. Yeah. I can't every, I, every single straw. I milkshake, anything. I can't drink out of a garden hose. I need to like cut the flow down. It's just a thing. All right. No, no, no. That is, oh. that is wrong. It's your you, turn. It's meant to be high wide flow. Open. It's meant to be high flow. What did you learn from me? I would say you're kind of go with the flow attitude. Like kind of just letting you things. You haven't learned that yet. I'm practicing. Practice. <laughs> but I learned that from you. Yeah. But I'm practicing it. Because right. I'm very much like a scheduled plan ahead person and he's very much so like go with the flow. And we're complete opposites when it comes to that. So I would say I've learned to kind of let things just happen versus try to control every little aspect. I'm trying. It's hard for me, but I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that would be, I think, the biggest thing I've learned from you. Well, that's good. That's a good thing to learn. Yeah. Question number four. Which food do I like slash hate? What's my, what food do I love? Mm. You like pizza? Mm -hmm. I do like pizza. Yeah. And what I food? don't know if that's your your favorite food. <sighs> Depends on my mood. Yeah. And the day. Yeah. I and mean, what's my least favorite food? Liver. Ew. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. I wouldn't say that's like 
my number one thing I would think of, but yeah, I wouldn't think oh, of Oh, I happened to see a liver the other day, so oh, okay. I saw that. Because <laughs> you can... <gasps> the hair's attached. I have an ear hair? Pull it out. No, I can't. I hate pulling stuff out. Ouch. <laughs> Did I get it? There's eight year here. Okay, anyways, continue. I'm this, getting this old. Is, this is gonna take forever. Oh, if I could live anywhere in the world, where would it be? On a field. In the middle of a field. No. Anywhere in the world. Yep. I would say like Montana, Wyoming, yeah. Texas. Anywhere with a lot of land. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Alright. What am I good at and what am I bad at? <laughs> what am I good at? <laughs> See what? What? Uh, what are you good at? I should have had pre preparations for these questions. You're good at planning stuff. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah. <'cause... laughs> yeah. Okay. And what am I bad at? Not planning stuff. <laughs> <laughs> what? That makes no sense. Like going or, with the flow. Yeah. Doing stuff that's all right. You're bad at doing stuff that's, that's not, not scheduled planned. and that's planned. That's not planned. Yes, correct. Yeah, you just can't just go someplace and right. not Right, we're have, working on that. Well, you can't go someplace and not have an expectation of what you're going like to expect. A plan. You, or no, like a, you have an idea of what yeah. is going to happen there, yeah. but you don't always need that. You can just go there and just experience it. You right, know? right. What drink? Do I always order a beer? No. Or like something with whiskey? I don't. I wouldn't necessarily. A whiskey I sour. Wouldn't, hold it. I guess I wouldn't say it has to be an alcoholic drink. Oh, Mountain Dew. Hands down. <laughs> I thought you were talking like drink, drink, like alcoholic. Yeah, drink. yeah. Yeah. No. Hand, hands down, Mountain Dew. There's no question yeah. about it. All right. What is one thing you wish I didn't do? Ah. Uh... Sleep with one leg out of the cupboard. <laughs> what? That drives me nuts. Why? Because then you roll and you have to keep that one leg out. And all of a sudden, all the blankets are on the floor. Yeah. All right, fine. And I freeze. Fine. Well, that's the one thing you're never going to change about me. <laughs> so, good luck. <laughs> well, that's one thing I wish you didn't do. Yeah, but I was thinking, you know, maybe I'd be nice and I would, like, work on it, but... Not that. All right. There's no compromising on that. <laughs> I don't get it. I just, it, I don't know, I can't. It's just, I can't. Well then, I'm just gonna sew the blanket on one side so you can't pull it. I'm not sleeping on that side. What? I'm not sleeping on that side. No, on my side so oh. you can't roll it off of me. All right, same thing to you. That's one thing you wish I didn't do. Burp all the time. Like out loud burp. It drives me nuts. Oh, but you gotta get the good ones out. No. You gotta let them. Mm -mm. Yeah, let him sing. Mm -mm. And he passes <laughs> gas a lot too, and that drives. Oh, let's not talk about that. <laughs> All right, something else besides that. Your chewing drives me nuts, and you. Oh, and you're slurping your coffee. I could list a lot. You know, <laughs> oh, keep <geez>. going. <laughs> but uh, one thing I wish you didn't do, I have to say burping. Like that really bothers me. I don't like when people burp out loud. I really don't. You do it once in a great while. Yeah. That'd be my thing, I guess. And I wish you planned more. Yeah, that's not going to change. <laughs> Probably neither one of those is going to change, but... Anyways, <laughs> question number seven, where would I love to travel to? What is one place that we always talk about that I'm like, we're going on our honeymoon? Oh, Bora Bora. Mm-hmm. The one place. Yeah. Which one of my hobbies do you find least interesting? Right? Yes. Least interesting? Mm-hmm. Hunting? Why? Because I don't mind when you work on your truck, because at least I could, like, learn something. And I don't, like, snowmobiling can be interesting. That's, I guess it would be your other hobby. Fishing's kind of interesting. Like, your, all your other stuff is interesting, but hunting? You should really. come sometime, then. Mm. You're going to see a lot of nature. I've made it four and a half years. All right, what? <laughs> <laughs> Question number eight. Where was, oh, that was the last one. Question number eight. I'm ordering pizza. What toppings are on it? Cheese. Correct. Just yeah, cheese. Just cheese. I've been in just a cheese only phase for about like a year now. 
and I just, I just, I don't know. There's something about just plain pizza that, mm, so good. I'm not going to disagree. Cheese is... Sometimes I like the toppings, but yeah. most days I want just, just cheese. Cheese pizza is good. Yeah. Not going to knock it. Yep. All right, what's your Supreme's question? Supreme's pretty good, though. What do we usually argue about? Planning. Because <laughs> that is honestly, like, we are... We're similar in a lot of ways and also different in a lot of ways. That is probably the but most... But that is probably the most polarizing yeah. part. Like, we yeah. are so completely opposite on. Yeah. So I would say we're constantly... Not constantly, but we if we're arguing, it's mostly about him not planning and me planning. Or me not knowing what a plan is. Right. Number nine. What is the first thing I do in the morning? Grab your phone and look at it. Yeah, it's a bad habit. What's the second thing I do? Roll over and pester me. No. I go pee. Oh, well, that, yeah. <laughs> Am I a morning or an evening person? Evening. For <laughs> sure. That's not even a question. Oh my gosh. You a morning person? Never. Unless it's like before a vacation, then you're a morning person. Or Christmas. But mm. other than that, I'd you say are. if I have something important going on that day. Yeah, uh, I, hunting, if, prime yeah. example. He'll get up at like the butt crack of dawn to go hunting. Or a, like a road trip. Yeah, definitely. I'll get up early, but... Number 10, what's my favorite color? I don't know, pink? At the moment, yes. What's my like go-to color? Black. Yes. Yo, you know me so well. Yeah. How do I spend my vacations? Doing something, an activity of some sort. You have to constantly be like, go, go, go. Yeah, I have a hard time relaxing. Like, I would say, like, you have to be going on, like, and doing something, like, outdoors. Yeah. Or something history-related. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Question number 11. Who is the dominant one in our relationship? Who, me? Excuse actually, me. I, it's actually probably both of us. I think we both have, like, you know that question where it's like, who wears the pants? We both have a leg, for sure. Yeah. It's very equal, and I think that's why we work out so well. Yeah. Yeah. We each have our things we're stubborn on. But we put our foot down no. when we need to, and we're. but we also respect that boundary. Like, if he puts his foot down, I'm like, okay, like, I know. Yeah, I don't know who's more stubborn, me or you. I know. Probably equal. Yeah. But, anyways. I don't know. Ooh, if I won $1,000, what would I spend it on? Truck parts. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> I know you so well. <laughs> What kind of? All right, hold it, hold it, hold it. Let's go more in depth because that's too easy. Turbos, tint, rims and tires, running boards. Oh, she's got the list of stuff that needs to get done. Yeah. I like how the turbos were the first ones. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Everything else is second to horsepower. Question twelve is: Which of my hobbies do you find the least interesting? Where do I begin? Oh, <laughs> I don't even have that many hobbies. Well, yeah, but your hobbies are makeup <laughs> yeah. and shopping. Yeah. And reading. Yoga. Yeah. Gym. I okay, I do have a lot of hobbies. Okay, but what's your least what do you find least interesting? That's a tough one between the reading, shopping, or makeup. All of them? I'm surprised I didn't put yoga in there. <laughs> yeah. I took yoga really and truly all of them. I don't find them interesting, all right? Rude. Just all oh, three of them I can't really... Relate to. Yeah. Well, the shopping one, I mean, I guess it depends on what you're shopping for, but mm -hmm. I'd say that's probably I mean, the can, most interesting... We can tell them about the time that you drugged me around Cabela's for five hours. Let's add up all the time you've drugged <laughs> me around Alta and Sephora. That five hours is nothing. Oh, yeah. But that five hours and that day all at once was just a little too much. Mm. But they have a restaurant we there. We went around and around in circles. And we ate food. Okay, anyway. Saw the ducks swimming in the pond and the fish. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they're lucky I didn't throw a lure out and catch one. <laughs> Am I a mountain or a beach person? Mountain, for sure. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Why is that? You're very much more, like, rustic, outdoorsy. Yeah. yeah. I guess that'd be fair. You're a farm boy. Why would you be, like, more the beach type? I don't know, because we live a mile from the lake. Okay, yeah, but like you're more like, you would much rather go in the mountains like snowmobiling and like that kind of thing. Yeah. I like how the mountains look. It's cool. See? What was my least favorite subject in school? History. Yeah. I hate history. I don't hate it now as much as I did 
and it's like I have a more like appreciation for it now like learning our history but at that time in my life like history wasn't important to yeah. me I just wasn't in that like I was more the science math girl yeah and but you've kind of also that could go back to what you I've learned from you is you've kind of like given me the appreciation and like taught me the appreciation of like yeah, why knowing you, our history yeah why we need to know it why it's important where am I on a Friday night home playing video games or watching a movie or a TV show that we're into mm -hmm. you're with me chilling out where would I like to be this kind of goes like goes hand in hand with the other one from earlier snowmobiling no well, where would I spend a thousand dollars oh working on your truck yeah yeah that'd probably be where I'd want to be okay fair enough because if if I just had a thousand dollars to spend I'd spend it on that and then, and then you'd be working on your truck and I'd never see you. Well, you could come hang out. Sure. sure. There's nothing wrong with that. All right, the last question is, what have you learned from me? I stole this from you, too. What have you learned from me, sweetie? I learned <laughs> to put the toilet seat down. Oh, <laughs> you, didn't, you did that anyways before me. No, I didn't. I never so did. So dumb. I wanted a good one. <laughs> I guess it's to be more organized. Yeah? Yeah. You don't see it here, but like at work, I'm more organized. Okay, I'll take it. All right, okay. you gonna use that first one or front? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. What's your question? What's your last question? Ah, uh, my you? last question. All right, I got it. What is one thing I love doing, but most people don't? The first thing that I can think of would be you are the very first one to offer help. And a lot of people don't have that like work ethic like you're always like you will not sit back and let someone else do all the work like you're right there hands-on mm -hmm. and like you're right you're gonna be the first one to offer your services and to help which a lot of people like I don't want to say like a lot of people but most people aren't as willing as you are to like help but yeah. what, is that what you were thinking of or what were you thinking of no I was just seeing what you came up with oh. all right well then yeah <laughs> that's my answer <laughs> I didn't really have an answer for it. Oh, there you go. All right, you guys. So that was it. We learned a lot about each other. No, I was kidding. We learned a lot or things we already knew that... Yeah, we already knew it. I'd say we passed. I don't know. We know each other pretty well. Yeah, I mm -hmm. suppose. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Happy Valentine's Day, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Oh, also, before you leave, if you enjoy having him on my channel, leave a heart down below so I know. And maybe you can be in more videos. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Bye guys.